There is a school of thought that says the waffle fry is the superior fry. True or not true, we will find out today. You know, it might be the lesser of the fry family. And when I say lesser, I mean the less well-known. Because how often do you see waffle fries? I think there's only like one fast food place that does them. Carl's Jr. Carl's Chick Jr. does them. Oh, Who? Chick-fil-A does Chick them Chick-fil-A. Ah, uh, Chick-fil-A does them too. That's right. It's delicious because the thinness and the, and the waffleness, the holes, make more crispy area somehow. I think in my mind that actually makes sense. I think you're right. More crispy surface area. More crispy surface area. Thank you. I went to college. You always have a good way. He did go to college. I didn't. I'm actually, only saying that because he always said Actually, it. not true. Well, I went to two years of junior college. Technically, I, I didn't graduate. I'm missing an accounting credit. Mr. Clough was a dick. I just could not get the concepts in my head. All right, so uh, here's our plan. We make the waffle fries. We'll cut them, put them in water, let the, the starch and stuff uh, soak off them. We'll make uh, four sauces. Then we'll bring the uncooked fries back. Then we'll fry them, and then we'll have them with the sauces. It's a simple concept. I got nothing else. Let's go. Before we can do anything with a potato, we've got to get the slicer thing set up. And I think I've only used this guy once, but I know what you have to do. You have to, oh boy. You know, there's a school of thought that says, oh, here we go, take that out, there we go. I got to get a different blade in here. Mother freaking effer. Do you see this? See those little blades come out? Mm -hmm. Like little shark things. That's not what, I need this to come out. That's not coming out properly, I don't think. Oh, there we go. Oh, I get it. Okay, so now we take... That was way too difficult. It, well, for me. Well, I didn't go to college, so... Okay, now I need the wavy cutter. This guy. Was it like this? Uh, yes. yes. Yes, it has I to be, right? It fits in like that. Okay, so the feet go in there. Oh, boy. Here we go. Should we go take a break? Can no, no break. We got it. Okay, so the plan is when you get the potato cut, you, you make one cut and then you alternate and that will help give us our waffleness. So let's prep one of these guys. And I tried to get long ones. These two are better. I didn't want giant ones. I wanted like that size. So here's what we're going to do. Let's use this guy first. We'll cut the ends off and then we'll peel. You know, for a little bit of the eye stuff left is okay. You don't have to be super anal about it. And if you have an old potato, your first cut, your first peel like this, will give you green underneath. And then you know it's old. So it's still fine. A few more wax to get it nice and clean. All right, let's just do one. Make sure we got the system down. Now we can do this. So one swipe through. And you see now you've got these. So I went this way. Now I'm gonna give it a 45. Look it, it's a little baby one. <laughs> Great. It's so cute. So now you just have to go back and forth. It's, not f***ing, it's making like shreds. Yeah. Oh boy. Hey, you got a YouTube channel. Shouldn't you figure this sh out in advance? Well, Should come on. You? I maybe sh Look, if it wasn't obvious, the point of this show is to be encouraging, is to show you how you can actually make things. There's all kinds of YouTube cooking channels. They're just showing sh off. We want you to cook. Part of my thinking in making you confident is showing you that it's okay to screw up. See how I erased the. Totally intentional. That? Yes, this was. Thank you, Max. Max said. Planned out. He got it. it was completely intentional. The script said, then now Sam f***s up. All right, let's continue and see if we can make this right. Okay, ready? One. All right, now there we are. Now look. Okay, there we go. Now That's I see it. waffle fries. Okay, but hold on. I forgot which way I'm going. Yes. Those are not waffle fries. Where are the holes? Now they're too thick. No, they're not cutting yet. Oh, but I can't. If, if, it's not our day, people. I, I can't make it any. I think this is a good machine. Well, they're waffling, but they're they're too thin. Okay, so maybe between the two of those. Uh, there isn't a between. This is the way to do it. I know it's the way to do it because you can see there's a waffle. Yeah, I know. It's like almost there. These are like have the right thickness, but yeah. You know what holes. I wish? I wish this was back in the days when we did this live because somebody could tell me what the f I'm doing wrong. I think this thing is, want, seems like it's moving. Instagram moving. live right now. If you really, here, do you want to do that? Yes, let's, shall we? Here. All right, you're live now. So, uh, oh, here. Yes. Hey, uh, so here we are shooting an episode, and I'm trying to make uh, waffle fries. So this is just, it's a little too thin, but when I thicken up the, when I make this thing a little to cut thicker, I just get this. Is anybody out there that knows what the hell is going on here? Please <laughs> help me. Why well, I just saw a thing that said a request to be in your live video. Kelly Zion requested to be in it. So say yes. That's a join? Happens. I don't help. know, I hit accept. Oh my god! <laughs> See, I told you! <laughs> what was that? Kelly! What? 
You know people can see you. I oh my god. I just Long. saw it and I started watching. Oh my god. Okay, well, All right. Well, Hang it up. Hang it up. I'm saying goodbye. I'm sensing the title of this. We tried to make waffle fries and this happened. <laughs> <laughs> now that I think about okay, hold on. Wait. Yeah? Waffles don't have holes in them. The holes are unintentional when they're made. This is I a waffle. He's on that's a waffle fry. That's a waffle fry? Waffles don't wait have a sec, holes. Wait a sec, that's wait that's a sec, wait a sec, wait a sec. That's it. That's it. Chancy, can you get a picture of a waffle fry? Yep. There you go. I know, but I'm saying I don't know. Waffles that's don't have fr waffles They do. Don't have holes. They have What are those? Waffle, I'm saying waffles don't have holes. But waffle fries have holes. Watching. Here's one with no holes. Chance. Yeah, see, sometimes they come like that, which is nice. I like it. Okay, I got to get them in water no matter what I do. Okay, thank you. Thank you, everybody. We'll do this again because it's been terrible for me, but hopefully good for you. Okay, well, that was fun. But now, look it. I think I found the right... Wait, don't walk away now. Look it. Maybe I found the right thickness. Okay, they got to get in water because they'll start turning brown and nobody wants that. And the starch will come off. Okay, I'm going to cut a couple more. You don't really need to watch that. But look, I did get some starting to come out okay. All right, let me just cut a couple more. I'll clean up and then we'll make the sauces, all right? All right, that was rhetorical, all right. Okay, so as I'm doing a few more, they're, they're looking actually okay, but I've decided to leave the, uh, the skin on. Okay, we got lots. We're good, look at it. We got waffle fries. All right, a little cleaning and then we're making uh, some sauces. Simple ones, delicious ones. All right, five sauces. First one is really basic, it's this. It's sour cream, it's barbecue rub, it's a little lime juice. Beautiful. And we mix. Next up, we have honey mustard. So we'll start with some honey. We'll go equal parts honey, mustard. Come on, buddy. Hard for it to come out of that thing. Mayo, little lemon juice, pinch of salt and pepper, and a little smoked paprika. Because you know how we feel about smoked paprika. If you're going to use paprika, may as well be smoked. That's it. It's like you've been watching oh, this show. I've heard you say show. that about a fucking million times. I wasn't going to say that. I was, only, I was actually going to say because we love it. All right, beautiful. Look at that. Yum, yum. All right, next. Okay, this guy begins with a little mayo. Look how beautifully uh, cupy is when it comes out. It gets some adobo sauce out of a can of chipotle peppers. Wow, this is fabuloso. A little cilantro, some lime juice, tiny salt and pepper, and we mix. Snap. Damn it, I love this stuff. I love it. And one final. Okay, for this one, we're using the mortar and pestle. This is avocado ranch. So half of an avocado, then I'm just gonna make these little cuts in here to get it out easier. And then we scoop, fantastic. Okay, so let's give this a teaspoon of lemon juice and I'm gonna mush up the avo. Max will want me to use my left hand. I can't, I have to use my right hand, Max. Okay, for a little richness, we'll give it about a tablespoon of sour cream and mayo and a little ranch seasoning, salt and pepper. Look at that. It ain't just smelling good, it is looking good. This one needs a little taste, wouldn't you say? Mm, tangy, ranchy, and a little bit chunky. Love it. These are, this is gonna be fantastic on the now literally perfect waffle fries. Here they are, out of the water, and I've dried them as much as I can. We know, oil and water. Don't mix, especially water and hot oil. So the oil's about three and a quarter. We're gonna give them a first fry for about three minutes, and then take them out, crank the oil to about the 360, 370, finish them off. We'll just put them in gently. Everybody thinks my job is easy. I not only have to cook, but I have to keep my body positioned so you assholes don't get mad that I'm in your shot. Beautiful. Twice cooked waffle fries. We're not looking for them to get brown this first time. It's just an initial cooking. All right, first fry's over. Let's take them out, drip away. We'll paper towel them for now. I'm gonna do one more batch at this level heat. You don't need to see that. When you see them again next, We'll turn it up to 375-ish, get them beautiful and crispy. Okay, here they are. I got a little anal, so I separated them, but now they're just gonna go into the hot oil. We're at about 375 now. It is not gonna take long, hold on. Let me get a couple hands ready. Look at the color, already it's going fast and furious. So I'll do these in two batches. I could do them all, but I won't because can't separate them fast enough. 
Therein lies the beautiful part of uh, the double frying process. I think you get a better fry on your potato, whether it's a regular fry or waffle, but then they go faster. You could have them all done in advance, and then when you're ready for them, they only take a couple of minutes. How gorgeous are these? All right, I'm gonna throw a little salt and pepper on these, do the other batch, and then we eat. We'll start with our sauces, and right in the middle, I'm gonna put the avocado ranch, and then beside it, some honey mustard, lovely, and then the uh, barbecue seasoning, and that guy. So Max reminded me to add a fifth, and that is what we love back in the day, ketchup with a shit ton of pepper on it. Very simple, very good. And the chipotle, lime over here, and of course then, our waffle fries. Living back here, all freaking gorgeous. Bam! Seasoned with salt and pepper, ready to go. Okay, it was a bit of a mish getting to the point where they cut the way we wanted them to cut, but we got there. Alrighty then. I don't need to taste them all. I'm gonna taste two. I'm going with pepper ketchup because it's so old school in our family and we love it. And the key is, you pound the top of the ketchup with so much pepper, you hardly see ketchup. And Max reminds me, and then reapply as needed. You hear that? Crunch. Mmm. Mmm. Like, stay right there. I want to do the avocado ranch because, damn, that one's good. Mm. All right, Waffle Friday. Successful? Yeah, there was a few missteps as we'd say. I've got freaking grease all over my glasses. Oh, I just made it worse. Fuck. This is unbelievable. Here, I'm going to just do this. There, now I feel like I'm underwater. Yes, thank you for hanging out with us. Don't eat the same thing all the time. Make these. Take the time. It's not a big deal. But making your own fries, your own waffle fries, whatever is so much better. This is the worst thing I could have done to my glasses. Fuck. Oh, and by the way, while I've got fucked up glasses, I lost a pair of sunglasses in Dubai. Prescription sunglasses. 